Good morning guys. It is Thursday, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I think Ronan is 10 weeks old today. Um, yeah, it's already probably like 10.30 or so and we've already been nursing and I took him downstairs and put him in his little swing and he was so yeah. happy this morning. Oh, he's so happy right now. After he eats, he's just full of smiles. And um, yeah, so I got a nectarine and then I put him in the pack and play and he let me take a shower. And then I got out and actually I was going to blow dry my hair like I just started and I put him down here um, on his little play mat. See, he's just looking around. But when I started the hair dryer, he put out his little lip and then he just started bawling. So I guess I've never really blow dried my hair around him. Um, when he was in here and I blow dried my hair, he was always asleep. And then any other time, Stu was always watching him and <laughs> oh, he's smiling. Okay, anyways, but yeah, so he started bawling and I just stopped blow drying my hair and I picked him up and I don't know, I couldn't really calm him down so I just nursed him and um, now he's naked because he spit up on himself, but that's fine, it was just his pajamas, so I guess I'm going to skip the blow drying for now um, and just do my makeup. So it's not even five minute makeup. Ronin. <laughs> Hi. That's right. Hi. Oh. Hi. <laughs> yeah. That's what I thought. Can I have a smile? Yeah. Thank you. I love your smile. <laughs> You're so cute. Well, that was interesting. I've never had him poop while he was doing tummy time, so obviously it all floated to the front, which made cleanup interesting, huh? <laughs> party, 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 party. A party, 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 party. <laughs> dee, 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 dee. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> He's so cute. Let's put some clothes on you, huh? Okay. Yeah? Dee -dee. <laughs> you give yourself the hiccups. <laughs> we just had a nursing session. Oh, he's so sleepy now. Oh, you hit mama in the face. So I think we're probably going to have a little cuddling nap session. Um, we did a lot of cuddling and napping yesterday when I didn't vlog, and it was really, really nice. He was so sleepy yesterday. Actually, I took a little clip, so I'll insert that. He was really tired yesterday, and you were so cute. Little Ronan here took like an hour-long nap on my chest, and he's having so much trouble waking up. Look at him. He's so relaxed. He's so pretty. I love you. He's so cute. Look at this sweet face. One, two, three. One, two, three. 
You like your head to bobble in. Yeah? Yeah? I was watching some KK and Baby J. Bronx is just chilling. He always like looks so relaxed. Makes me really jealous. Look how huge he is though. Just keeps going. And this little wiggle worm made a huge poo-poo while I was pumping, so he feels like a lot better. He's so much happier now. <laughs> Go run it! Dancing made Ronan very hungry, so I came up and fed him for like 10 minutes, literally, and he fell asleep. So I'm just scrolling Tumblr and we're blogging stuff because, yeah, I've had a Tumblr for like, I don't know, years and years. I can't even remember when I got it, in college or maybe before that, so it's been a long time, um, but I haven't been actually on it very much lately since I had him, and yeah, I miss it. I only have like 2,000 or so like followers on there, but I like it that way because it means that I've known all those people almost for a very long time, so it's like mutual subscriber kind of thing. And I do have a really close friend on there, or I mean, I haven't met her, but we send letters and stuff before, and she is pregnant, so I'm so excited. Um, I don't think she's told a lot of people yet, so I'm not going to say who she is, but girl, if you're watching this, I'm so excited. Especially since, like, none of my other friends have babies or are pregnant or anything, so finally someone I can talk to about baby stuff. What are you doing, Ronan? What's happening? But anyways, yeah, um, you should totally make a pregnancy vlog if you haven't thought about it already because I really love doing it. And if you did, then I would follow you, and, um, yeah, if she does, then I will totally link you guys up with her because she is adorable. Adorable. He's like eating his hand in his sleep. I gave Ronan some gripe water because he was angry and then he was doing okay so I started pumping and he was crying his eyes out. And he's okay if I hold him but if I put him down I will show you. Yeah. Mama will pick you up. So I think we're gonna go rock in the rocking chair. Look, Zoe's here to see you. Hi. Hi, Zoe. It's a good nice. The baby's sad. <gasps> Hi. Are you gonna make him feel better? Mwah. No, 
noisy chair, noisy chair. This is a noisy chair. You think the only people who are people are the people who look and think like you. But if you walk the footsteps of a stranger, you learn things you never knew, you never knew. Bronx, get off the chair. Bronx! <gasps> that naughty kitty! What is he doing? He's gonna ruin the chair. You tell him no. And we are all connected to each other in a circle. In a hoop that never ends. She glanced this way. I thought I saw. But when we touched, she didn't shudder at my paw. No, it can't be. I'll just ignore. <laughs> but then she's never looked at me that way before. You're spitting, you spitty boy. Yucky, grossy. Ready? Are you ready? No. And a bit alarming. Who'd have ever thought that this could be? I just rocked running to sleep. Um, it's only like five, so I'm going to make some dinner. Probably just like there's a sausage in there, there's like a potato somewhere, you know how it is. I'm just gonna piece together stuff. <laughs> Bronx is like, he wants so much attention now that I have the baby. He's like, he flops over wherever I am. Even if I'm on the toilet, he tries to flop over near my feet. But. Hello, Fiatty. I need to brush him more. He's like shedding. Like, look at my pants. They have so much cat hair on them. It's gross. Anyways, I will show you Ronan sleeping really quickly, and then probably the next time you'll see me will be for question of the day. Ha, uh, just kidding. I came downstairs and he was wide awake, so I'm trying to push him around in the stroller and while my pizza is heating up and see if he'll go back to sleep, but probably not. You think you're so funny? You're wide awake, look at those eyes. Come on, go to sleep. He says, no thanks, mom. Look at his little hand. <laughs> go to bed. Ah, oh, yes. He's asleep, finally, so yeah, it's like 6.40 right now, um, because I had to feed Bronx and do some other things. I had to pump again um, before I could come up here and do question of the day. So question of the day is by Sophia H. Let's see, she asked, question of the day, if you could go on a family holiday, where would you choose and why? So when you say family holiday, I'm going to assume that like my mom and my sisters and people like that can come with me. I thought about this because at first I was going to say like Hawaii or something but then I was like why would I choose Hawaii when that's like I mean I know you'd have to fly there so it is kind of far away but it's still in the U.S. so then I thought about it some more and I think that I would take us to New Zealand because that is where Lord of the Rings is filmed and we are like big Lord of the Rings fans and also it's just it's so beautiful it's so lush looking there like I feel every scene from Lord of the Rings and if you watch all the like um, special features where they show the landscape and all these things like all the mountains and just it's so beautiful and it's not overcrowded or anything obviously <laughs> there's a lot of nature there so it would be really peaceful and I wouldn't want to take Ronin somewhere like, I don't know, like Cabo or something with tons of water and places because he can't swim or do anything fun. So might as well go somewhere where it's not like amazingly hot um, and just relax. 
and be at peace with nature. <laughs> so yeah, that's my answer. I would probably choose a different place like every week, you know, I mean, where you want to travel sometimes it's like what mood you're in, like what do you want to do this week, and this week I want to relax, so that is my answer. Thank you for asking. That was a fun one. Um, now I'm just going to probably like plug my headphones into this little Roku thing and watch an ASMR video because it's still light outside because it's summer and like as farther summer goes along it gets lighter out sooner which sucks because it makes it hard to sleep. I am not a good napper so I'm definitely gonna need to like relax, listen to some gentle whispering. And Linz, if you're watching this, you are so right. I watched it with headphones the other day and it sounded amazing. Like she was just whispering in each ear. Everything sounds just a hundred times better. So I don't even know how I've gotten this far watching it on my iPad with the sound just like bl blurring into the room when it could be right there close to me. So thanks for that. Um, but yeah. I'm gonna go so if you like this video then give it a thumbs up and if you're new then introduce yourself and subscribe and welcome to my little family so see you guys next vlog bye